What's up guys, Mercalia back with another video and I got the coolest, most craziest guy uh, around, Felix, a okay, Zon. What up everybody, it's Zon, how you doing? I know I haven't uploaded in years, but it's okay. Yeah, tell us, like, how's, how's life, I guess? I've been very busy, honestly, been very busy. Yeah. I haven't had the chance to record, I recently moved out of my mother's house. And I've just been busy just trying to catch up on bills and stuff, and just, just uh, haven't had the time to record. That's pretty much it. Alright, time to call on the horse. Chose the white one. Probably the guy said it was good for battle, so I was like, yeah, could use that. Alright. Alright, Felix. So, Marco, tell me, how, how, how are you liking the game? How are you liking the game? I'm liking the game. It's just that, like, I've been trying to save it because, like, I'm up to part six and walkthrough. I'm trying to record some pre-record pre much, but I want to keep playing it. It's just that I don't want to get a hand tune in the story because I still want to record that. Which is why I haven't been playing it that much. Uh, that's interesting. Yeah. Hey, as long as you like it, buddy. As long as you like it. I know, I like it. It's full RPG, but there are some things, like, some people point out it's, like, microtransactions, which it's got to... Because, like, it sucks that microtransactions, like, they still add it, though. Especially for single-player games, it's, like, not necessary. Cause like, cause, uh, fortunately, since I have uh, a lot of points for Ubisoft Club, I was able to get an XP boost uh, to level up a bit faster. And then, um, if you want to get more, you could buy them. Or let's just say you don't want to grind for a lot of resources, you could just buy them. No, it's like kind of, cause like that's kind of like basically paying your way just to um, not grind that much. Takes the aspect away of the game. Yep. Isn't but, that what every Call of Duty player does when they have money? Well, I'm not trying to be mean. Well, if you, anyway, if you got a lot of money to spend, you're gonna spend it on a bunch of COD points. Yeah, like but basically, yeah, 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 because basically, if, uh, plus, plus, it doesn't have any much value too, because like you're just buying like stuff like for like items they could just like um like go collect from either side missions. Or just like just go finding around the world. Instead, you could just pay up actual money just to um, you know, just to get the resources quickly. That, that I kind of like don't like because especially single player games, that's like not that's a big no no. All right, I'm gonna turn off my mic. Cutscene. We are ready when you are, Captain. Wait! Wait for me, Alexios. I'm all packed and everything. You're coming, are you? If you're going, I'm going. Kefalonia is the only place you've ever known. You'd leave your home. I would if it meant staying with you. You can't go where I'm going. I need to be alone. Who's going to keep you company? I'll be fine. If I can't come, then take Hara. Hara? My pet eagle. She's my friend. Mother gave her to me. But she'll be your friend now. And it'll be like I'm there with you. You know, to remind you of me. Thanks, Phoebe. But you have to promise we'll see each other again. I promise. You haven't seen the last of me. Just stay out of trouble until then. I will. Don't worry. Okay, you can leave now. Alexios! Leaving Kefalonia without saying goodbye to your dear Marcos? Tell me it isn't true. Well, you're here now, so it won't be true. Goodbye, Marcos. All these years as a dynamic duo! I'll never replace you! Well, I may need another assistant someday, but it won't be easy! Come now, give me a hug! <sighs> All right, come here. Yes, bring it in! Oh, will I ever miss you, Alexios? Thanks, Marcos. I'll miss you too. And what does the future hold for you? Wine, of course! No, you never know when the vines will wither. I'm always ready for another adventure. 
Speaking of adventure, I have a task for you, dear Phoebe. An adventure? Yes! Already following in your footsteps, isn't she, my friend? Ready to set sail? Alright, I'm back. So basically, I have a choice here. I could either go... Alright, we're both back, technically. I could either... Here's the thing. I could just go straight away for the next area, or... I could not go yet and finish any side quests. But for now, just for the story's sake, I'm just gonna say, alright, let's go. Prepare to cast off. It's time go to for it, lady. The tides wait for neither man what nor you believe in. Time to go. Alright, let's do this. Oh, still a cutscene? Okay. So, what course do we set? Where in this big, beautiful world does the mighty Alexios want to go? Megaris. <laughs> Megaris? But we'll be sailing into war. I got a contract for some general's head. Whose head? They call him the Wolf. The Wolf? Who wants Nikolaos of Sparta dead? Nikolaos of Sparta? Spoken <laughs> to prevent Sparta's fall, the child must fall first. You can't let this happen. Please, she'll do no harm. She'll help us. She will lead us. Silence! <laughs> Get me to Megaris. Now. But I don't understand. Of all the places under Ilios, why risk our necks to go there? The wolf of Sparta is my father.
Nothing like a sea breeze. Does the deck always feel like it's moving? <laughs> I've got the perfect opportunity for you to get your sea legs. Oh? What would that be? Well, when the Cyclops was giving me a drumming, his pirates took my cargo. I know their ship, and I know where they're heading. What say we get it back? Sure. It'll be a good opportunity to see how your ship and crew perform. All, All right, right, we're back. Then. Let's get moving. Let's see how the sea goes. Felix, you still there? Felix. Can you hear me now? Yep. All right, I have my mic muted, so I want to interfere with the video. Yeah, because there was a cutscene going on. Somehow made me feel a similar type of way. You'll see soon, oh, Gilly, once I upload it, because I'll probably upload this part today. All right. So right now we're on a ship, finally take command. It's, it's kind of cool that they actually, even with this timeline, that they still added this. Can we hunt dolphins? Yeah. You can actually hunt sharks and I think dolphins too, I'm not sure. And I heard that you could tame animals like a like a lion, wolf, and a bear. I've always felt that mood, Felix, about how you're always in like some kind of fighting mood even though you're just like doing daily activities or just doing nothing at all. I don't know why. Sometimes too, whenever I'm like around just family or my own kind. Alright, we're near the ship, we're gonna annihilate. I remember seeing similar gameplay, but in uh, AC Origins, but but I don't know how this will work. And um, Okay, this game. Uh, uh. Alright. Yeah, this give me black flag vibes right now. Except. Yeah, because you'll see in the gameplay soon. Because there, there's even gameplay uh, similar. Because there's certain parts of Origins where they did the same thing too. Where instead of like these guys with spears instead of like cannons. Which is really awesome. And also Ubisoft 2 is planning on making like a black flag type of game. Oh, really? Was yeah, the black flag not that good? No, black flag was really good, man. Cause like it's kinda like a refresher to the I'm franchise. Still trying to figure out how did he have eagles? Ready yourself for boarding! Uh, and not sure. explain that. Yeah. Probably in some kind of only Sarno Sarno Bloodlines had that. Oh, yeah, you could board the sh sh ship too, apparently. Oh! Yeah! Boom! Kick you off the ship! Yeah, kick the big dude off the the ship. Yeah. 
Japão. Cara, Nossa, uh, I boarded the ship and uh, annihilated this. Alright, so my ship's health is restored now. I guess I still gotta destroy this. I know. He'd be a valuable asset. When can we meet him? Well, you're going to have to persuade him. What do you mean? You get him aboard and I'll All right. talk him into I'm gonna... a little oh, mind, Felix. Uh, turn off your mic quickly, Felix. So that cutscene. Knock him out. No, no. Well, maybe just pacify him a little. Then get him to the ship so we can have a little talk. Everything will be fine. I promise you. We're back. Alright, quite completed learning the ropes. 1700 XP, and now we're almost close to level 7. So now we gotta go start recruiting, I guess, like um, captains for a ship. So I guess it's basically the commander for a ship to help us. Uh... That's the island. You'll need to be cautious. So. It will be crawling with pirates. Dock the ship! What I kind of like too is um, to for Eagle Vision, what to do with the Eagle Vision, they actually have an actual Eagle as your companion to help you look from a distance to find, scan for enemies and like uh, search for your obje objectives. Nice. They had introduced it in Origins and they did introduce it again in here in uh, Odyssey. That's my wow. So now I gotta pacify this guy. Recruiting lieutenants. Recruiting people in the world to make them lieutenants on your ship. Use knockout damage and abilities to pacify an enemy before I still to join your crew. So L3 is just to knock them out. Recruit. If you're willing to work for it, I pay my crew more than you'll ever make here. Make a worthy addition to the crew. So unlock the new guy. Right now I can't shoot anyone. Alright, so I gotta go to ship menu. Go to my ship right now. Assign lieutenants. Hire an assigned lieutenants to ship and gain multiple benefits. Once assigned lieutenants also join your boarding party. I need to unlock more skills, so I got an epic one, which is Evie Fry uh, from AC Syndicate that I got from New South Club as a lieutenant. She gets 15% fire javelin bonus, 9% javelin bonus, 18% damage while low health. Uh, okay. And then I just hire this guy, which does, for now, it's assign him because he has plus 3 arrow damage. That shoot him out of arrows, god damn it. I forgot I could craft more. Go to inventory. <laughs> yep. You're not talking to me. The fuck? It is past twenty minutes. Alright. Let's see what else we got. So you can do it. Get the fuck off of me! Why are you rubbing my nipple? Oh, What's here we go. John, hurting me. Marco, oh. help. I don't know what I can do about that. It's true. Girls, I'll, I'll make Marco look worse as well. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> oh god. Oh, this is gonna be an interesting video you're recording, Marco. 
Uh, hopefully nobody uh, heard it. Nah, you won't get flagged from that. There's people that say a lot of worse things. Hold up, hold up. Got him. Got him. Land of the gods, Philokis. I, I can't speak Greece. Athens waistband. Got a ton of loot stuff. Got some drachme. Which is the name of the currency that you, that you can. They used to buy stuff and upgrade a few things. Got some metal. Alright, anything else? It's okay, Mark. I believe in you. That's alright. All right, let's see. Anything else? Anything else? All right, just, I guess go to armor. I guess level five. All right, it's twenty armor. Thirty armor. Okay, put this on. No one will match my other stuff. Fifteen, sixteen. All right, five, three, five, six, sixteen. Put that on. I right, got better armor now. I think that should be about it. Oh, more, more money. Which apparently I can't take for some reason. There's a glitch where I'm using my ability to unlock to like scan for anything, for items around the area, and it shows it. But I'm trying to pick it up, and it's not letting me pick it up. That's weird. Alright. Alright, time to get back on the ship. I got you. Good. He'll be a valuable asset to the crew. Will he be enough? Don't worry. There'll be plenty of opportunities to include more people as we go. Something tells me we're going to need them. Uh, we should set a course for Megaris. Salvage nearby! Oh yeah, um, I got, I occasionally find these stone tablets around certain areas which are puzzles. Which basically, they say like, uh, there's certain areas where they're like, like for, for example, the, it's a, it's a tough one that, that I solve, which is in my inventory bag. Which I guess, it gives you special engravings that you can put in for your weapons, there's documents. For example, one of them, Fatal Attraction. If you retrace the steps of Osidius and take the path north, you will find a goat from farm in Ithaca where he once met Athena. She helped him with the disguise to reclaim his wife and kill her suitors. Find your reward on a slaughtered goat. Slaughtered goat. Let's move! Yeah, I know. But I guess apparently they give you, uh, like, engravings. For your weapons, all right. Journey in the war, trek. Get the oars ready. Yeah, it's cool that your um, crew also sing shanties too. Alright, there's an Athens ship, yeah. Yeah, this game is really interesting too, so... And the DLC, upcoming DLC for this game is gonna be awesome too. It's gonna be like more linear story based, kinda like episodic. Or they even give you the option too where you could wait 
for like the whole thing to come out. The first one that will come out, like I think in January and December, is called The Story. Okay. Oh god. The Athenians have right. blocked the entrance to the bay! Alright. Well, I don't know. I saw it looks like I'm about to set another edge. When? Oh, I didn't touch it. I didn't touch it? No. Oh. Uh, I, I would have definitely noticed. Alright. Well, I'm gonna have to end the video here. I need to check something.